And let's continue on down to where the girl is. Maria, I believe is her name is. Now I think about it, I wasn't really paying attention when uh, she was talking, so I don't know for sure what her name was. But uh, I hope she's still alive. Good grief, they had to make it a really long trek, didn't they? I guess they wanted to make sure that uh, you had to climb a long way. Now I think about it, that idol that thing that I got. Maria's body flies still, yeah, it's probably going to be used to, to help her, right? Let's go ahead and do this. There's a recessed hole in the forehead. Right now, it feels powerless. Oh, okay. Uh, in that case, we probably got to go out of here and go to the goddess's palace. That's my guess, anyways. Actually, wait. Before that, I'm going to go back to where she is because... I'm going to call ha Hadat, I think that's his name, and see what he has to say. All of the prisoners in the shrine were turned to stone. Okay, he's just repeating himself, never mind. So now, I just have to avoid these crazy enemies as I make my way down. That should be easy, right? There's no need to fight all of them. Whoa. Some of them are really, really... Powerful. They run really fast, too. I should heal and save here. Okay, so let's explore this area. To the left first, because why not? I guess I'll go to the right as well, just in case. I have a feeling it's also going to be a dead end, yep. So you just gotta go straight up. Uh, just making sure. So what's gonna go on in here? We are the goddesses of East. Please come forward. Uh, this feels more like a boss arena than anything to me right now, but okay. Oh, it is good that you have come. We have great need of your strength. Now, in order to reach the core of the shrine where we await you, you will need to find and use the second pendant. Some of our people have been turned to stone, and one of them carries it. You have the dream idol. You can use it to restore those who were petrified to their normal selves. Observe, there is a recess in its forehead. If you place the black pearl there, you can awaken the idol f from its dream and dispel the curse upon the people. Please bring the p black pearl here when you have recovered it. Uh, oh, Keith has it, right? Because I think it's, uh currently blacked out in my inventory. Yeah, see how it's blacked out there? I can't even equip it right now. Um, I'm going to search this area very fast, so before I go back out to where Keith is. Uh, okay. So up here we go. Oh, neat. You can kind of see the uh, land from here. So we've explored quite a bit of uh, this game's world, and it seems like we've explored basically all of it at this point, right? Well, actually, no. There's still some places in the sewers that we haven't explored. Um, so now we've got to make our way back to Keith, who is in that tunnel all the way to the right here. Ah. Darn you. Hmm. You know what? I can get rid of this guy. And this guy. For the EXP. Okay. Oh, he's not here anymore. Well, that's not good. Uh, I have no idea where he would be right now. I'm gonna heal up. I'm gonna try calling uh, Hadat again, just to see if he has any wisdom for me. A black pearl? I'm not familiar with it. Don't, you don't know anything more about it. It's never come up before in your travels. Well, yeah, but... 
the person who has it right now is Keith, and I don't know where he is. Darn it all. Uh, okay, so I have two options. First of all, I want to see whether or not I can teleport... Okay, I can teleport to the Goddess's Palace. That kind of helps a little bit because I don't want to have to uh, run back up here. But now I have to decide if I want to uh, try to find Keith in the shrine or not. Okay, I'm going to go check for Keith up here first. And if I can find him up here, then great. If I can't, then oh well. I was thinking maybe he'd be by her, but obviously he's not. Another option is is that I could actually just look it up. Because this place is big enough to kind of warrant that. But I still want to give it a try. I still want to try to look. Before I uh, give up. Oh wait, maybe he's by that statue. Uh, the one of uh, Sada? Oh, here. Down here and then to the left, right? Yeah. But I don't see Keith up there. Maybe if I interact with the uh, the statue, though, it'll trigger a cutscene with Keith. There's a statue of a swordsman here. It seems strangely out of place. Okay. Another option is to teleport over to uh, the area, the runaway hideout. Maybe Keith is in here with them. No? Okay, thankfully I looked it up. Uh, man, I would have never guessed what I had to do. So I have to go talk to Tarf. And Tarf will mention something at, that will cause me to be able to talk to some monsters. Which, in turn, will allow me to find out where to find the uh, pearl. What's wrong, mister? Huh? Black pearl? Aren't pearls usually white? Oh, is that what you call that stone you gave me when you got me out of the cave? In that case, I have it. Um, uh, I have it right here-ish? Or not? Would Keith give it back to him? Oh crap, there's a hole in my pocket. That stone was so small too. I don't know if I could possibly find it right now. Don't even know where I dropped it. I had it when I got to the village, that much I know. I was playing around with it in my pocket when I talked to that guy with funny eyes. You know, the guard? I'm really sorry, mister. I hope it wasn't super important or anything. Adult told Tarp not to worry and reassured him that the Black Pearl would surely be found soon. I'm super duper sorry. Since I dropped the Black Pearl after I got here, maybe somebody found it and picked it up. That's what I'm hoping. So now I need to go talk... Maybe it wasn't monsters I need to talk to. Maybe it's the guard that's all the way up here. Uh, talk to him. The Black Pearl? I saw a man in a black cloak bend down and pick up a pebble or something a little while ago. I'll bet that was it. The question is, where did he go with it? It's kind of weird. I only took my eyes off him for a second and suddenly he was gone. Uh, okay, I'm gonna go heal first and then go uh, up to the, uh, you know, back to the shrine. So I do need to talk to these guards here. The meeting's finally over. Lord Dalles apparently just recovered something that brought the meeting to a sudden close. What was it, you ask? Beats me. Something extremely important, that's all I know. The meeting's finally over. Lord Dalles apparently recovered. Okay, they're just repeating what each other said, right? So I've got to go to where the meeting room is, which is in the fact territory. No time to talk now. Go about your business. Okay. So let's go in. And there it is. Reobtain Black Pearl. Wow. Just wow. I don't know what to say other than I can't believe that they required you to do all that to be able to get it back. Anyways, so now what I gotta do... There's a recessed hole in his forehead. Right now it feels powerless. Oh, I've gotta take it back to uh, the Goddess Palace, right? So let's go ahead and put this and teleport over there. 
Okay, I saved just in case. I thought for sure that Keith had it though. I'm pretty sure that Tarp said that he'd taken off with it or whatever. You know, the Black Pearl that is. As the Black Pearl was set within the Dreaming Idol, a faint glimmer emerged from its darkened depths. Break the curse of our people. Travel to the top of Campanile and raise the idol towards the heavens to undo the spell of petrification. The final battle dries not, uh, draws nigh. We have called the priest descendants to come join us here in the shrine. It won't be long before they arrive and all are gathered in the ancient underground core of East. Please hurry to them. Okay. So now I just gotta go to the top of that, uh, that tower again. Hopefully, uh, Maria gets revived by this. I'm just running past all these monsters uh, as, you know, the little guy. Because I don't feel like fighting them. Check her out again. Maria's body is gone. Really now? Hmm, that's concerning. Up the stairs we go. And now I just got to use it, right? When Adol held the dreaming idol to the heavens, a bright light emanated from its forehead. And that leveled me up twice. Okay, I was about to say, is it going to level me up three times? Uh, anyways, so now that that's happened, I should... Uh, I can actually get out of here very quickly with the return magic, but I'm gonna run back down the normal way, just in case there's, uh, like, anybody that's here. Like, you know, Keith popping up, for example. But, uh, I'm gonna make my way back to where that statue of the swordsman is, because I'm pretty sure that that's Sada. And maybe he'll, uh, you know, have something useful for me. Hmm, still gone. Okay. Back to being the little guy. I can't believe Mistress Sava was defeated, but I guess she was always a bit haughty and overconfident. I almost defeated this guy. There we go. Now I can uh, just get by all these en enemies left. So let's make our way back to where Sada was. Who oh, I'm assuming was Sada. Who are you? It is Sada. I see, you reverse the petrification. Much obliged, my name is Sada of Ramia Village. I came here to res rescue my fiance Maria, but a man in a black cloak cast a spell and turned me to stone. Adol hesitantly told Sada that Maria had been sacrificed. No! Uh, I, if only I'd come sooner. Maria. Thank you for fighting to rescue her. Even if you weren't successful, I respect the effort alone. I have no further need of a sword. The one I sought to protect is beyond protection now. This sword has been passed down through my family for generations. As I've lost my will of the fight, I believe it would be put to better use in your hands. Please take it. Receive Claria Sword. Oh boy. It's no ordinary sword. It possesses an incredible strength. Really, it's the only thing that got me this far. Oh yes, in my home, there's also a suit of armor that is made of the same metal. If you tell my father that I'm alive and well, I believe he'll let you use it. Okay, cool. Let's actually contact him right now. Ah, so Sada is safe? Thank you for letting me know, Adol. Sada should be able to make it back on his own. Adol, I have something I need to give you. When you have a moment, please return to my house, alright? Will do. Uh, it sucks that we couldn't save Maria, but... Uh, the strongest sword of all, its blade glows, suffused with the, the magic of Claria. And the increase is uh, 23 points of damage? Wow. I'll be fine on my own. Once I've calmed down a bit, I'll return to the village. Please use that sword to fight on my behalf. I I've lost all the reason I ever had to fight the demons. Hmm. 
There's still some treasure chests in this place uh, that I haven't figured out how to get to. As well as, you know, that over there that I haven't figured out how to get to. I'm kind of wondering, like, if I run against this wall here, yeah, I can't get to that area. I don't know. Anyways, I'm going to teleport all the way back to uh, Lance Village very fast. And the reason why is because I have a lot of money now. And I'm thinking I can afford to buy that elixir that's in the uh, shop over here. The one that costs like 60,000 gold. I and I should probably get that right now. Elixir. Ah, you have a keen eye, sir. This is something of true worth. I'd even go so far as to call it my pride and joy. I know I said before I had no real must-buys here, but that's because this little vial is priceless to me. I put it out more for bragging rights than to actually sell it. In fact, it's the only one of its kind in all the world. I'm legitimately proud to own it. Quite the miracle drug it is. It'll bring you back to life after suffering a mortal, mortal wound. Wow. If I had to, I suppose I could sell it though I priced it well out of the range of most sane individuals. 60,000 gold is what I'm asking. Bye. Uh, he sold it to me. I... I can't believe it. You actually bought it? You must really have been saving up. It pains me to sell it, but I'm impressed by your dedication. Use it well, young man. Okay, cool. I can also buy some other things here, too. Uh, like, uh... What do you call it? I need to stock up on herbs. And then I'll go back over to the other town. Because, yeah, the herbs are the only thing I'm missing right now. But uh, this says, A mysterious potion which can miraculously revive the dead. Only one vial exists. I wonder if you have to have it equipped or if it just works automatically. We'll find out, I guess. So he will give me the armor. Ah, Adol. So glad to see you in one piece. Is that the Claria sword I see in your hands? I assume Sada gave it to you. Adol described his meeting with Sada to had it. I see. Thank goodness. Since Sada has entrusted the sword to you, please allow me to augment the set. So that's why we couldn't open up that treasure chest before. Oh wow, they're showing him carrying it, even. Acquired Claria armor. Cool. This is, uh, this is Claria armor, which my family preserved alongside the sword. Both were entrusted to us for the sole purpose of one day being handed down to the hero, led by the twin goddesses. That sword and armor will serve you quite well, I'm sure of it. If only I had the Claria shield to give you as well. 700 years ago, East became a sort of arc in the sky, if you will, and we've been floating here ever since. At all, I pray that your battle will end in victory. If you need my help with anything, do not hesitate to ask. Hmm, I wonder where we can get the shield. Anyways, so that increased my uh, defense by 13. Very nice. Let's talk to him again, just in case. I believe that your quest will end in victory. But if I may be of some help along the way, it would be my pleasure. So is he going to give me any other information, Sada? Don't worry about Sada. He's got an iron will. He'll be fine. He'll want to be left alone for a time, though, I imagine. What about Maria? Yeah, not much to say about that, huh? I pray for your safety. Please do what you can. I'm gonna go uh, back to where the uh, people were in the runaway hideout. The ones that, you know, like where Lilia is and stuff. Because maybe they have something to say. Wah! Air! Delicious air! I work with stone for a living, and let me tell you, getting turned into it is, much less reward, uh, is a much less rewarding experience. But that aside, we're saved! You did it! You saved us all! I knew you'd pull through! When I came to, Lilia was gone. I wonder where she could have gotten off to. This place is teeming with demons. It's not safe for her to be here alone. May the goddesses keep her safe and deliver her back into our care. Hmm. I was keeping my ears open while we were being taken away. From what I overheard, the demons are coming to the uh, from the East Core, which is even deeper underground than the canal. 
When I was being held in the uh, bell tower, I looked outside and realized I could see the world below. Could it be? Is East returning to the surface? Huh. Thank you for saving us. That friendly demon named Keith told me. Well, he said someone else in the shrine was also turned to stone, just as we were. I would wager that he's been changed back as well. Oh? Hey, Keith! What a surprise. Ah, a demon! We're doomed! Oh wait, false alarm. It's Keith. Adol, this is the man who helped us in the bell tower. Huh. Take care, I'm going something. It's a wing! We can use that to get everyone safely back to the village. Alright, we can go home! You're a real lifesaver. Don't worry, we won't get in your way. We're going to head back to the village. Thank you so much, Adol. If only Lilia were here, things would be perfect. Adol swore that he would find Lilia. Understood. I'll leave her up to you then. Oh, that reminds me. I picked up this up before I was captured. I found it in the old abandoned Rastini mine. No clue what it was doing down there. I think the area where I got it is called... Hmm, I want to say the Sacred District of Toll? Something like that? We'd never entered it before, but it seemed like we were being guided there, somehow. So we let our, left ourselves to fate. You may need it in your battles at all. You should take it with you. Receive gold pendant. Ooh! Ooh! Anyways, I'll see you later, Adol. You can do this. I know you can. I believe in you. Very, very nice. Uh, let's go in here very fast. Hmm. Okay, so I have two options now. I can go back to the Goddess Palace, or I can go back to that statue uh, that told me that I needed the different pendants to get to different places. I think I'll go to the Goddess Palace first, uh, but I'm going to save. And that will be the end of this video, so thank you very much for watching, and if you enjoyed it, please leave a like, comment down below, subscribe to the channel, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye!